all right guys welcome back to the other video in this video i'm going to show you how to develop this web portal containing the search button where you can search by latitude and longitude so if you search for 28 83 and then uh, it will redirect you to the uh, exact coordinate latitude and longitude position so let's get started all right to do so i have created the simple web application so here you can see i have the uh, title is leaflet search location by lat long and then i have body with the map and body elements uh, which having width of 100 percent and height uh, of 100 vertical height and then i have map element uh, where i'm going to assign my map and then I inserted leaflet.js and jQuery and then this is my map so yal.map and then this is the latitude longitude coordinate and then zoom level to 8 and then I loaded the OSM map so if I let's say open it with live server so you will see a very simple map containing the uh, OSM base map so now i'm going to add the marker first so to do so so let me add the comment add marker to map and then since i'm using the github copilot so it's suggesting me so i'm simply simply going to hit the tab button but for you i think you might have to write everything because you don't get any suggestion so i added the marker uh, with yarl.marker and then uh, in the center of this map i'm adding this marker okay so if i save this so now you will see the simple marker over here so now next thing is i'm going to add the uh, search button uh, so to do so i'm going to add another div here so div with a leaflet control uh, class and then also search class search yeah and uh, here i have to write the input form uh, since i uh, wrote these things uh, previously so it's suggesting me uh, the exact same thing so i'm going to enter the tab so here what i did is i wrote the input html input uh, which is kind of text input and then uh, this id i'll use it uh, to uh, make it more i mean the fix the position of this element and then uh, the placeholder is searched by lat long instead of this i'll write lat uh, comma l and g so that uh, user will uh, know they have to input latitude comma longitude from it and in the bottom i have id of source button and then uh, source so if i save this so you will get the ui having uh, these elements i think uh, currently the search box is over here so i have to fix this fix the position of the search box over here so to do so uh, i'm going to write the css so css is search and then uh, for me i don't need uh, this all the elements so i'm going to write it manually position will be absolute and then from uh, top it will be 10 pixel and then from right it will be 10 pixels so if i write and save it so you will see the search button over here so you will see lat come along uh, but even if you enter the latitude and longitude and click the search nothing will happen because we didn't add any event listener to this button so to add the event listener so uh, what you have to do is you have you can write the uh, jquery code over here so uh, this is simply a comment search location by lat long and then uh, it's automatically suggesting me the things so i'm going to hit enter and then i'll explain the things so first thing is uh, so from 
this search button over here so this is the id of my button so whenever this button is clicked then this function will run so what it will do is it will store the lat long into from this search id and then the value of this search id that means uh, whatever whatever things we input in the search box it will take the take it as a id and then uh, here um and the thing is uh, it will try to uh, i mean split our data by the comma since um, in convention we are thinking that the user will input the latitude and longitude in the comma separated list that's why uh, here is comma and then uh, of course our latitude will be first value and then longitude will be second one and then uh, I'm, i set map, my map to uh, the inter latitude and longitude and then zoom level to 8 of course you can change the zoom level as well if you want you can uh, add the other parameter called zoom level as well in the input field and then you can uh, simply extract it uh, using this lat long array and then uh, input it here but uh, for now I, I simply set my zoom level to 8 and then uh, here what I did is I updated the uh, location of this marker so marker that set lat long to the new lat long so if I do so and then save it so now if, whenever I input anything then uh, it will redirect my map to the correct correct location so let's say if i do minus 40 comma 40 comma minus 5 then enter the search button so it will redirect my marker to the exact latitude and longitude uh, but uh, of course it's not the uh, actual development version of the code because user might enter like uh, they might enter like some string instead of the number then of course it will throw an error message so if i hit search so you will get this error message so of course we cannot parse the string into the numbers so in this way yeah simply you can build the uh, like search engine uh, based on your coordinate system so i hope you like this video if you like this video hit the like button and subscribe to my channel thank you for watching